just noticing I don't have a mirror in the van. Anyway, so I am in Florida right now. So far, I've just been driving a lot, so I haven't really been filming any of it for my long videos, but if you wanna check out my short forms, I did a daily vlog every single day over on my YouTube shorts. So lots of driving so far. I met up with a couple friends in Miami, just kind of hung out. But today, we are finally going to check out one of the national parks down here, which I'm so excited for. It's kind of the main reason why I'm down here is because I've always wanted to go to the Everglades. Today, we're doing Biscayne National Park. I've been able to do a couple fun things, but honestly, I feel like the trip... But honestly, I feel like... But honestly, I feel like the trip hasn't even really started yet, so... Exciting. What are those? Turn right onto Arthur Vining Dave to Walmart. I wanted to pick up some new instant meals and I needed a new pot and a gallon of water. I should have ate some of this before I bought more. None of this sounded good. <laughs> I'm not buying any more food until this can be in. For lunch, I'm gonna have this salad kit, but I don't have a bowl, so I'm just gonna use this. Pretty good. So I'm super excited because I'm in the parking lot and look, I can already see a bunch of mangroves, mangroves right there. And I'm gonna be going paddle boarding through them. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I have like an hour before my little tour. So I'm just gonna hang out. I'm gonna find a bathroom, most importantly. I found the bathroom, but I also wanted to check out the visitor center so I could get my patch for my collection and I wanted to check out the exhibits. <laughs> They're like zombie teeth. And, and what happens is that they swim in the grassy areas. Uh huh. And, and then if they see it might be something there, they go <laughs> in the sand and, and they. Uh, uh, but they catch whatever gets, <laughs> they go up. Double bag my electronics. Water. And then I'm going to need snacks. And then I think I'm good to go. We're gonna go in the mangrove tunnel. He said we might have to lay down at parts, like on our stomachs. But when we're done in this city, we're going back to the hills to take it all back somehow. The guy gave me his glasses because you can see the fish way better if you have polarized. Just like 
Oh my god, that was amazing. That was so fun, so cool. And now I'm so tired. <laughs> I'm also starving, so I really want to make some food. This park closes in like 20 minutes, but every single spot is completely full of cars. So I feel like people are not going to be leaving on time. So maybe I do have time to make food. I wish I actually cleaned my dishes after I used them. This is always dirty. 99% of the time, it is always dirty. <laughs> now look at the van. Let's give you a tour. just gets dirty fast it just does I've been trying so hard on this trip to keep it clean and I definitely have been doing a better job than normal but I haven't even hung out in here it's just it's just the way it is <laughs> and it doesn't have to be that hot because it's hot out so I don't want it too hot <laughs> And if you're new, this is what I do for water. I just buy like one of these, one or two, and then refill them wherever I can. Oops. Okay, I definitely walk to the parking lot in my towel. I only brought like my wet clothes and I would rather do anything than put those wet biker shorts back on. So <laughs> it's kind of cute though. It's like a little skirt. Now I'm gonna change into some pajamas and hopefully do nothing for the rest of the night. <laughs> I'm tired, the sun takes it out of me. Alright, everything is all over the place because I need to get it drying. And I am right next to this Planet Fitness, so I really hope that my Wi-Fi hooks up to it. So once the sun goes down all the way, then I'm gonna drive over to the Cracker Barrel where I'm gonna sleep for the night. But I'm gonna just like wait it out here, keep using the Planet Fitness Wi-Fi, and try to research what I'm gonna do tomorrow. I have some ideas, we might just wing it, I don't know, we'll see. This is what Cracker Barrels look like when people sleep in them. We got some vans to the side, we got some campers in the middle, a couple of SUVs. This is honestly like best case scenario. Like I love sleeping in places where there are a bunch of like families and a big honking SUV. To me that just is so nice because, I don't know, it makes me feel safe. And of course, I'm back in. 
And that's just so if anyone tries to murder me, I can hop in the front seat and drive forward and I don't have to reverse. And then I climb in the back so I don't get out. I just climb into the back. Doors are locked. And then the very first thing I do is put the window covers on. Okay, window covers. Winder. Window covers are on. And now I'm going to show you how I make my bed really quick. Ta-da! Windows are covered. I'm going to eat some Pringles and an applesauce. And then I'm going to go to sleep. Okay, this lighting sucks, but tomorrow is going to be a very early morning. I have plans. We'll see if they work out. Okay, see you tomorrow.